I'm Alex West. My name's Yas. I'm a coach educator with Kick It Out. I'm a UEFA A licensed coach, more recently working as a coach developer. So we work with coaches to upskill them on everything, equity, equality, diversity and inclusion to make sure that the game of football is for all, make it a much better, equal, equitable place. I think a large part of being a coach developer is helping the coaches to understand some of the things that maybe they could be doing better and some of the things they haven't yet considered. I think more specifically, identifying the differences between direct and indirect discrimination and the more aware we can become of the indirect discrimination and the unconscious bias that exists allows us to maybe influence and impact in a way where we're almost discrimination free. So my name's Tejan Hutton, I'm the head of grassroots and community at Kick It Out. My role in coming up with the initial initiative of having coach developers, so it's really innovating what education in the grassroots level looks like. I think probably the real way to break it down is just putting coaches in a perspective where they can look at the same situation through a different set of eyes. The fact that there is now a programme available for coaches like myself to come and learn about all the different types of discrimination, how we can help prevent that and it's a massive benefit to myself because I've, I've learned a lot already. Bringing coaches from all different walks of life, different areas of the country will hopefully allow coaches to take something away and then bring these ideas and approaches to their sessions. We've had some players with disabilities come on to our, our fun football sessions uh, and coaches maybe sometimes have had to deal with the negative environment created by other players not understanding what the disabled player is going through um, and we've been able to then work with coaches to address that behaviour, to bring in, to create conversations with parents, with players, with other coaches, other members of staff, uh, and really make that player feel at home. I think often we're so focused on like the technical development, but at the end of the day, if we're not creating an environment that is inclusive and where people will come back, that is just going to cut participation in the game. You know, if we can come here today, learn from them, and pass that on to our junior coach, and then they can then pass that on their career and that progression in their group of players, is that whole domino effect. We get people feeling included where they once were excluded, uh, and we get a better calibre of player got to remember at the end of the day the coach's job is to make better players by addressing everybody they can address all the players developing appropriately. Alex and Yaz I'm two phenomenal individuals they'll be freelance they'll be available at, at anybody's request and if anybody does want to upskill their coaches in regards to EDI inclusion Alex and Yaz will definitely be the first point of contact for you. I want to get out I want to get to clubs work with coaches work with people really make sure we have some impact through this work. You know, I'm really excited to be part of the team. I'm really excited about where we're going with this project um, and, and all the workshops that we're going to be delivering and I think just today is just the start.